guys it's a lovely afternoon and I'm going to try the Piper Cub around the pole for its maiden flight uh, it should be interesting there's precious little wind thankfully and the battery's charged so I'm gonna have a go just around the pole we'll see how it gets on it'll give me a clue as to how it's gonna fly uh, RC uh, so yeah let's have a bit of fun so I've got the battery is already in just got to hook it on and fly <laughs> Worryingly, there is a slight breeze coming from behind me, uh, so I'll have to launch there. At least I'll be out of the sun a bit. Okay. Oops. Now, what I thought was I could go under the wing band. I'm not going to attach it to the strut. I'm going to try and attach it to the undercarriage. But I can go down there because it's going back up there so that should hold it in that sort of attitude so I'll get the transmitter we'll do a walk around my dad's RC hanger neck strap rudder Elevator. I'll just dial in full right, rather trim, and then it's going to be flying out of the circle the whole time. Yeah, the um, weather vane says it's coming from over there, so let's, uh, let's just try a taxi. I've oh, got to admit, I'm slightly apprehensive. Yeah, the line went slack. I was putting in quite a lot of down then. Hopefully, it, oh, the carriage is bent. Let's have a look. That's nothing. That's just, in fact, it's not the undercarriage, it's the wheel, that's alright. It's the wing I'm concerned about. The strut, strut's come unstuck. Okay, let's go and fix that and come back out. Flying slow, which was good. We like slow flyers. I'll see you inside. I'll have to take that off a minute. Let's have a look. Let's see what we've done. What have you done? You know what I'll do? I'll just put a little bit of wood on the uh, inside just to strengthen that repair anyway. Okay, and the other item was the strut. Okay, that fixes the wing. Now we're going to do is look at that undercarriage. Um, I think, you can see, I think both wheels need to come off, but I don't think they do actually. I think I can. Can it hang there? I think it's just a matter of um, putting a load of epoxy because I should have made them out of plywood, I suppose. And really, I've got to decide now what actually happened during the flight. Um, it, once it bounces on that um, on that band. Um, it's very difficult to get it back under the control. I did bounce once, I think, and I got it back under control. And I don't think, I think it bounced it. Might even been a, it kind of, I've got the feeling it might have been slightly tail heavy. Because it seemed to be going, seemed to be flying up a lot, didn't it? I could add a little bit of nose weight as a precaution. 
and then take take it out later if necessary. So I'm going to add a little bit of nose weight, I think, guys. I think we're ready to have another go. Pop saver work there. Save the pop. No. So a second attempt. I've got another windsock out here now, guys. And as you can see, it is actually quite breezy coming from the right. So for a slow fly model, that's actually quite breezy. Okay, I've taken off that down elevator, sorry, up elevator, and the wind is kind of trying. So I'm taking off into wind now, it's coming from there. As long as I keep the nose down, I think, and the line tight, should be okay. Okay, let's give it a go, shall we? I'm going to try and keep it low. Okay. Prop the back a bit. <laughs> I've got full right rudder on. I'll keep it low. <laughs> this is maiden flight, guys. Taking that full right rudder trim off now. It's flying slightly down. I'm holding in a little bit of up. Can probably put a little bit of up trim back in. And sweet as a nut. I'm going to keep it low. You can see if it starts to rock into the circle, I've got trouble. I shall land immediately. Looks great when it comes back round into sun, doesn't it? Let's open it up a little bit. Bouncing a bit there. There we go. You can see I've got full right rudder on. It's very, very quiet. One minute. Okay. I'm not going to walk around. I'm really focusing on keeping this thing. Flying. I think I'm about half throttle. You can see the prop arc I can in in uh, real life. See the winds tr oh, trying. Took up a bit higher there, getting a little bit gun ho. Okay, next circuit, we'll see what battery I got left. Okay. <laughs> Great. <laughs> okay, pop it. That's um, that's quite successful, isn't it? Pity about the first little, but it says learning curve, isn't it? So yeah, very happy with that. So next step will be flying it uh, at Winars Perch, or if it's a, I could probably fly at RC today, but I'm not up the field. I'm down here. So thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe if you want to see the maiden, and I'll give the video a like if you like. <laughs> okay. 
Cheers, guys. See you in the next one.